The Gangnam Medical Center stands as a beacon of medical innovation. Its Cell Regenerative Medicine Research Institute is at the forefront. Here, scientists and doctors work tirelessly. They explore the very building blocks of life. Their goal is to find new ways to heal. The Institute has a special focus on natural killer cells, or NK cells. These cells are a type of white blood cell. They are a crucial part of our immune system. NK cells can identify and destroy abnormal cells including cancer cells and cells infected by viruses. The researchers at Gangnam Medical Center are harnessing this power. They are developing treatments that use these cells. These treatments offer hope to many patients. The Institute is dedicated to translating complex research into practical therapies. NK cell therapy offers a more targeted approach. It uses the body's own defense mechanisms. This can mean fewer side effects. It can also mean better quality of life for patients. The Institute's work is groundbreaking. They are exploring various applications of NK cells. They are paving the way for a new era in medicine. Consider the case of a man in his 60s with advanced lung cancer. His initial treatments showed some success, but the cancer recurred. His doctors at Gangnam Medical Center turned to NK cell therapy. They used autologous NK cells taken from the patient's own body. These cells were cultured and activated in the lab. The supercharged NK cells were then infused back into the patient. The goal was to seek out and destroy the remaining cancer cells. Autologous cells have a key advantage, a lower risk of rejection. This approach offers a personalized attack on the cancer. Another compelling case involved a male patient in his 50s with liver cancer. He also received autologous NK cell therapy. His own NK cells were harvested, expanded, and activated. The activated NK cells were administered directly into the hepatic artery. This targeted delivery system is crucial for maximizing the impact of the therapy. Delivering the NK cells via the hepatic artery ensured a high concentration reached the tumor site. This localized approach can be more effective. It also helps to minimize potential side effects on the rest of the body. The aim was to attack the liver cancer cells with precision. This innovative application showcases the versatility of NK cell therapy. The fight against cancer sometimes requires different strategies. Not all patients can use their own NK cells effectively. This is where allogeneic NK cells come into play. These cells are sourced from healthy, compatible donors. A female patient in her 40s faced metastatic breast cancer. Her immune system was weakened by previous treatments. For this patient, the team at Gangnam Medical Center proposed using allogeneic NK cells. These donor cells are carefully screened and processed. They provide a potent, ready-to-fight army of immune cells. The treatment aimed to control the spread of her breast cancer. It also sought to improve her quality of life. Scientists are now able to genetically engineer NK cells. This enhances their cancer-fighting capabilities even further. Consider a male patient in his 30s with malignant lymphoma. The medical team decided to use genetically engineered autologous NK cells. His own NK cells were extracted and modified in the laboratory. These super soldiers were then infused back into his system. This represents a significant leap forward in personalized and advanced treatment. NK cell therapy is not limited to fighting cancer. It also holds great promise for boosting overall immunity. This is particularly relevant for elderly patients. As people age, their immune systems naturally tend to weaken. At Gangnam Medical Center, researchers are exploring how NK cells can help. They are working to rejuvenate the immune defenses of the elderly. One example is a female patient in her 70s. She experienced recurrent infections and low vitality. She received NK cell therapy designed to bolster her immune system. The therapy involved infusions of activated NK cells. These cells help to replenish her body's natural defenses. NK cell treatments can also alleviate the severe side effects of conventional anti-cancer treatments. Chemotherapy and radiation therapy can damage healthy cells. NK cell therapy can help mitigate these issues. By strengthening the immune system, NK cells can help the body cope better with anti-cancer drugs. They can reduce the severity of side effects. They can also help the immune system recover more quickly. This allows patients to tolerate their primary cancer treatments better. The advancements in NK cell treatments at Gangnam Medical Center are remarkable. They represent a significant step forward in immunotherapy. These powerful immune cells have diverse applications. The goal is to provide effective and less toxic treatments. NK cells selectively target and destroy abnormal cells. Research into enhancing NK cell activity is ongoing. 
boosting immune systems of elderly individuals could impact public health. NK cells can alleviate side effects of anti-cancer treatments. This can lead to better long-term outcomes. The future of NK cell treatments is vast and exciting.